Morning guys, this is day two, uh, the full day two of our holiday. We are um, getting ready. Our plan is to go to um, Islands of Adventure today. However, we've got extra park hours um, to get into Diagon Alley um, at <coughs> Universal Studios um, from seven till eight. So we're gonna do that first and then we're going to hang around Universal Studios 8 till 9 and then hop on the Hogwarts Express train um, over to Islands of Adventure. So, yeah, that's our plan today. Tilly is wearing... I'm wearing my Harry Potter t-shirt. A new Harry, different Harry Potter t-shirt and, and her Harry Potter shorts again. I am wearing another Harry Potter t-shirt and my Harry Potter shorts again. And Poppy is wearing Harry Potter t-shirts, a pink skirt, and some frozen sandals. And her frozen sandals again. And Chris is I'm wearing clothes. <laughs> He's wearing clothes. So let's go. and the Forbidden Journey. Unfortunately, Poppy was too small to go on it. Um, but but um, Tilly was fine, but we did the parent swap. And I must say, it was really, really easy to use. And there was a movie going on. But in the parent swap room, there was a movie going on. Um, they, were, they had Harry Potter playing. Um, but the parent swap was really easy to use. Um, they give you a ticket. Me and Poppy went and sat in the parent swap room, watched Harry Potter while Chris and Tilly went on the ride. Chris and Tilly came back, and then they let me and, and Tilly go on the ride. Tilly and Chris loved it. I 
I don't know whether I loved it or I hated it. It was fantastic, an amazing ride, but I've never felt motion sickness before, but that one did make me feel a little bit sick. Um, but yeah, it was good. Um, came off that, then we went on a flight of the Hippogriff. Girls loved that so much we went on that twice. Um, now we have just come to have a little break. We have come down the side of the free broomsticks, in between the free broomsticks and the toilets. There's a little passageway where there are some water fountains. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but there are loads of tables and there's no one around here. And you can see the castle from heaven as well. Hang on, bear with me. I'm a bit slower than everyone else. No one really uses purples. The restaurant's packed. And you've always seen there is. So yeah, the restaurant is packed. And then you've got the seating area with the car It's lovely and cool out here at the moment. So yeah, they've got all fans and everything. But yeah, loads of seats. Yeah, the restaurant is packed and we're the only ones sat out here. Um, although we're not eating amazing free broomsticks food. We're eating fizzy, fizzy belts and fizzy laces. Yeah. A great perfect mid-morning snack. Um, but yeah, so yeah, we're just relaxing for, the, for a couple of minutes before the park opens and we can um, go and enjoy the rest of the day. I think we are gonna head towards Kong. It's gonna be our first to next ride. No, don't. Thanks, Ellie. So no. we'll go on the Hulk first. No. Like. no, you're going off on the Hulk. Why yourself? Tilly. You're no. seriously too small. And Poppy's too small. We shall see by the end of the day if Tilly goes on the Hulk. I don't think so because I don't want to go on it either. I don't want to go on it. Me and myself. But you know Daddy will dare you. No. Anyway, see you in a bit. Don't put your fingers in. You may bite. just wanted to show you this as I've just been looking in the shops and come across this they have got Harry Potter purse like handbags but they're not just any they are I don't know if you can see this they are Danielle Nicole ones and she's the one designer who also created the Disney ones there is also Slytherin I can see here. There is also Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff. But I can't see any Gryffindor ones. Obviously those ones are quite popular. They must have sold out. But yeah, quite interesting to see those ones here. They are $48. <laughs> so guys, we've just been on Con, Con and, and it was good. Poppy's rating was 8 out of 10 and mine was 7 out of 10. Poppy, what's your rating? Mine was an 8 out of 10. It's really good. I've also been on um, the Triceratops thing. Not Triceratops, the... Oh my yeah. goodness, what is it called? Can I feel like it's a Triceratops. I think it's it's up there. That's Jurassic, where I don't know if you can see it. But you go up in the trees and you fly over. No one's going around it at the minute, but it was really good fun. Oh look, keep it long enough. Here you go. Oh, no one's going around it, but you fly like that. I like that. that. Yeah, we went on that as well. And, 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 after that, and now we got a donut. The girls are going to have, I don't know if you can see, 
this pink donut yeah. and Chris is now trying to get our refillable mug station um, filled. It is now, it's not even 10, it's 10 to 10 and we've struggled to find anywhere in Islands of Adventure where you can get your refillable mug stations filled up. Um, everywhere seems to either be closed or they won't reactivate it. Um, so it has been a bit of a struggle and it seems like he's still struggling to get it reactivated because he's taken his time. But I'm now going to share this for the girls yeah. and they're going to have a nice snack. But yeah, and then we're going to go on to our next adventure. Oh, lots of steam and mist behind us. chicken and ribs <laughs> that's all you get for your fish and chips and that's your cider wedges and that cost us too much 37 dollars which is a lot of money and I didn't realise for that much money you can get such little amount of food so yeah not good but yeah if I knew that I wouldn't have got it so much or so little for us to share so we'll, we'll be we'll have to order more food later anyway we best go dig in and let you know how it tasted later eternal glory first our friends from the north please greet the proud sons of the Dunstrang Institute the lovely ladies of the Bobaton Academy of Magic! Where did you buy this coffee? Let's take it out of the rubber. I bought 
Daddy. What's in <sighs> Honey Duke Sweet Shop? In Honey Duke. So here's the cauldron cake, as you may. Yeah. Guess. Rubber thing, isn't it? Is it? I think that's. I think that's cake. Now I'll probably use. Okay, get it here. I think that's cake. Cake alcohol. We use pill dogs. Pop it on Tilly. Tilly tries. It's really good. Yeah? Alright, Tilly try some. So this is the cold. This big one. Lots of icing. Is there any cake yet, or is it just icing you've come across? Yeah, I can, I can see some cake. I think, I think I'm going to just try and spot the cake. And search for the cake. What flavour cake have you got there? I think it's chocolate. Yeah. Do you want a spoon, Poppy? Will that be easier? Yeah, I think so. I found a bit of it, and it's chocolate. Okay. Every day, that by your poolside bed, you have ducks and a raging volcano or a smoking volcano. Volcano Bay, that is. Well, after I, we left you guys. We ended up going to Seuss Landing and went on lots of really random rides, <coughs> including what was it? One fish, two, two fish, fish, red, red fish, fish, blue fish, and got very wet. Yeah. Cause I did get mummy wet on purpose. So, so we I'm also went on a ride that went on the really high track as well. I don't know the name of it. The high track ride. The cool. That's it. It weren't very made that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Tilly wasn't very impressed with that ride, were you, Tills? No. No. No, I don't know she what went, it is. She went, mm, well, that was very boring. <laughs> oh, yeah. No. Yeah, that high track ride. We went in the Cat in the Hat ride. Yeah, um, was... And then we popped in the Christmas shop on the way out and then came back to the hotel. Uh, and then we went to um the we went to the hotel pool where we you may have seen the footage where of the ducks in our hotel pool which i have never seen ducks in a hotel pool before um but yeah we chilled by the pool for a bit before coming back to the room and chilling out and watching alvin and the chipmunks and the greatest showman um, we are now ready for the art evening. So should we show the girls? Them well, no, but the girls want really random hair. Show them your hair, Tills. <laughs> <laughs> and Poppy's hair. <laughs> really random. Oh, and Poppy just wants to show you all what she bought with her money. The girls have their own spending money, um, which they've been saving. Um, and come here. And this is what Poppy wanted to spend with her money. I don't know if, if you can see. No, no, no. Uh, Poppy wanted to buy a universal Christmas ornament. There we go. And that was ten dollars. Ten. What was it? Ten dollars ninety-five. And yeah, so the girls have their own spending money, so they can buy whatever they want with it. And that was one of Poppy's first purchases of the holiday.
Yeah, so this whole meal is exactly the same price as what we paid in Harry Potter Free Room 6 We are now back at the room. Um, cowfish was really, really nice. We were all really impressed, all loved the food. Um, I loved my burger. It where when we went to Krusty Burger the other day, it was really dry and just an ordinary sort of quick service burger. The burger today at Cowfish was absolutely amazing. Um, I even got a bit confused when he went, how would you like your burger cooked? Because I'm used to not having my burgers pink. I'm used to having my burgers sort of well done. So that was a bit strange for me. Um, Chris loved his burger too that was really good the girls loved their meals they ate them all up they weren't too keen on the little fish on top of the rice crispy treat um so they got left but other than that a fantastic meal i think that only cost us um 50 dollars for two adult meals two children's meals and um two diet cokes because we ordered the girls waters iced waters so yeah fantastic meal good price um, i would highly recommend going there um i really enjoyed today going to islands of adventure was lots of fun although i must say out of the two parks i prefer um universal studios compared to Islands of Adventure. I prefer the rides more, I prefer the atmosphere of it more, the layout of it more, compared to Islands of Adventure. I I don't know what it was. It was it was a good park and it, it was a fun day, but I preferred Universal Studios more. What about you, Chris? What I agree. Do you, he's just chilling out after today. You agree the same? Yeah. yeah. It was just, so much yeah the theming of it it was just better so um yeah it was good it was a good day but yeah yesterday at universal studios was better um tomorrow is uh, gonna be a lot more chill day we are off to the outlets for a bit of shopping so yeah more relaxed and just stress-free no parks, no rides, just shopping. Good fun for me. I don't know about Chris. The girls love it though, because we're off to the character warehouse. So I don't know if you guys have ever seen the character warehouse, but it's a fantastic place. If you ever want Disney merchandise that's cheap, because it has a lot of stuff from the Disney parks that you can get at the character warehouse for at a lot cheaper price. So we'll show you that tomorrow. But now it's time for me to go to bed and rest and get a good night's sleep. So I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.